Welcome to FarmBot HQ. We moved into this place in July of 2018. It's a 5,000 square foot warehouse and office space located in San Luis Obispo, California. So this is where about half of the FarmBot team works, where we conduct all of our hardware R&D, and also where we store and ship all of the FarmBot kits and part orders from. So let's go for a tour. So this is our modest showroom. In here we have some important prototypes from the past. This one, for example, is FarmBot Genesis V0.0. It's a little rusty now, but if you actually go into the hardware documentation, you can see uh, some photos of this when it was uh, a little bit more glorious. We have a few other prototypes in here that we'll probably bring to market uh, in the coming years. And then if we go through here, we'll see the main warehouse space. In this area, we package up all of the individual parts and partial kit orders. So on these racks, we have boxes, filler material, uh, baggies, stickers, tape, everything needed to package up the individual parts that we send out as replacements or when, for example, a DIY builder is building their own farm bot or when somebody's upgrading one of their farm bots and needs additional parts. Then we come over to this station and we can print out the shipping labels uh, and also the, any customs information if it's an international order. And then we put it on the box and send it out the door. In this area of the warehouse, we store all of the complete farm bot kits that are ready to ship out. While we used to package up the final kits ourselves, we now receive these kits fully packaged up and ready to go from our manufacturing partner. So we just need to put the shipping labels on. We use these pallet jacks and the rolling carts and also this really fun pallet stacker to load and unload kits from shipping trucks and also move them around the warehouse. And over here is where we have racks that store all of the replacement parts for the latest generation of the FarmBot kit. So these are all the V1.4 replacement parts and individual parts that we sell in our shop. So over here we have uh, spare universal tool mounts packaged up nicely. We have the different buttons used on the electronics box. We have complete electronics boxes ready to be shipped out. Cameras, cables, tubing. And on these racks there's even more parts, all of the plates and aluminum components, all the plastic parts, the belts, the USB cables, uh, some of the hardware parts over here, the V wheels, and also these partial kits in case you uh, don't want a complete farm bot but want to just uh, get the plastic parts for example. And then in here we have the V1.3 spare parts and in here going way back in time the V1.2 stuff. We have a handful of 3D printers, as well as a horizontal bandsaw. This is the equipment that we use to prototype parts and modify stuff so that we can develop the next generation of the hardware. And in this room are all of our prototype parts from the past. So these are things that we purchased online or gotten samples made for. Uh, it's everything from uh, little electronics PCBs to solenoid valves, to other electrical components, old aluminum parts and plastic components that didn't usually work out and then they, they come and live in here. Or sometimes they, they did work out and we ended up shipping some of those components with the FarmBot kits. So in here we have just racks of, of all of those old parts. And then upstairs is where we have our computer desks set up and it's where most of the magic happens. So this is where we uh, write software, where we test new hardware designs and do most of our CAD work. So we have in-person team meetings. So let's check it out. So we got a handful of development farm bots up here, everything from just simple electronics to what we call farm bot junior down here. And we use these prototypes to test out new software features, do quality assurance checks, uh, and also test out some new hardware parts and, and prototypes. Uh, moving all the way up to the full-scale hardware prototypes. Uh, these are actually the production uh, kits that we've sent out and we're using it to conduct tests and again try out new software features. So that's FarmBot HQ. We've really come a long way since our first warehouse and we look forward to outgrowing this one. Cheers!